Guys, my parents are not at home. I should talk louder. Anyways, um, yo guys, welcome to another video. In today's video, I am gonna help you solve some issues that maybe that causes your life split to not work and at the end of the video i'm also gonna be telling you a very useful tip that could save up so much of your energy make sure so make sure you stick till the end all right so the first thing you want to do is to right click your life splits and then you want to click on your edit splits from here you want to choose your game name which is minecraft java edition just gonna wait load here sometimes it takes some time God, dude, holy shit, it's so slow. Right, here it comes. Choose my card Java edition and then choose which category you are running. I'm running any percent glitchless, so I'll choose that. And then, next thing, you should see in game time is available down here, and then you want to press settings. Mainly, you want to um, activate it first. And then you want to change says location so if you don't know um minecraft java edition speedrunning is time with in-game time so if your in-game time is not working that means that um maybe the mods are gonna like oh this guy he doesn't have in-game time and your run may took longer to get verified or some shit so make sure you have this in-game time with the correct saves location so if you if your in-game time doesn't work um mainly maybe your safe location is wrong so you gotta press save locate change safe location and by the way before you do this um you're gonna bring up your file explorer right here and then from the top here doesn't matter um if you are windows 10 or 11 um user you're gonna click the view up here i believe it's on the top usually and then you're gonna um, click it once and then you hover to show here and then make sure you click on hidden items in order to choose your safe location after you've done that you're gonna minimize this and then from here you want to go to this pc and go to os and then you want to go to um users and go to users again and then you add data right here um, click on roaming Then you want to search for dot minecraft right here Then you want to choose saves right here and then you click on ok However, this is um for the default minecraft saves If you are using like a uh, multi mc which you should be using um, it's like 10 times better than the original launcher so um, Using it is definitely an advantage. So you're gonna click on ok and there you have it you should see your in-game time working and then you click on ok the next thing is you want to show your in-game timer so in order to do this you're gonna right click again and then you're gonna press edit layout as you can see this timer is actually the rta not the in-game time so there you have this and then you're gonna click plus timer and then timer again so you can see there's two timers now so i'm gonna bring this up again double click on timer or you could press layout settings and you should see this pop out and then um, press on timer and from here timing method as you can see you're gonna choose the game time use this and then click on ok so now you have two timers one is the real time which spent in real life time spent in real life and <clears throat> a time which is spent in game so they are both not the same so make sure you know that oops and then you click on ok so now it's the very um time saving or energy saving tip i'm um, just gonna right click and then click on edit splits again from here you click on settings up here and then 
enable auto splitter um this only um applies to version 1.12 or above if you're using a version that is not 1.12 or above you will need to um go to your hotkeys to set to um, activate your timer so what this basically does is it basically um starts your timer when you load in a world automatically and then it will reset your timer when it's when you're in the loading screen so it's actually really helpful you don't need to mess with hotkey stuff if you're using um version 1.12 or below you can go to your settings and turn on global hotkeys right here and then these stuff are pretty self-explanatory i don't really need to um explain all of these it's really easy to understand and then you can press ok and that's basically it and yeah that will do it for today's video and if you like today's video make sure to hit the like and subscribe to my channel it really helps out a lot and make sure to watch my how to sell multi mc video and peace out guys